guys, what's going on and welcome to my channel. So for today's new video, I am lip swatching and reviewing the new Ultra Matte Lipsticks by Nykaa. So they offer a total of 10 shades and I picked out these 4 shades right here. And the reason I picked out these shades is because I thought these 3 will be good on a day to day basis to work and everything. And this red is only because it's red. So that's why I picked out these four shades. They offer a total of 10 shades priced at 550 rupees each. Now for the description of the product, this product is manufactured in India. However, it's formulated in Italy. It claims to be an extreme matte finish, full body pigment, long wearing and weightless formula. Now the surprising and a happy thing about this product is it is cruelty free, it is vegan, it is paraben free and dermatologically tested. So I'm really surprised and happy about this. I never knew that before because this is the first product I have ever bought of Nykaa. I think I popped my cherry with these four right here. So yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know about it. So on the packaging front, it is beautiful. It's black with gold detailing on it. This right off the bat reminded me of The Great Gatsby, the movie because their posters, wallpapers, theme, everything was almost exactly like this. So that's what it reminded me of. I love the fact that they have named all these shades with different women, iconic ladies throughout different era. So that is like awesome. So for the packaging of the actual lipstick itself, I like the fact that the, the cap is the same color as the shades and also that these are magnetic which i had no idea about and this is fun and distracting and i need to stop so without any further ado let's move on to the lip swatches Now for my thoughts of this product, I feel that this is a matte but it's a not complete matte finish until you take a tissue paper and dab a little bit on your lips and then you're good to go. But until then, there will be transfer as well like for example, let's see this. And now I feel that after the top layer of this lipstick is off, this is the matte that I personally prefer. Uh, just another thing is I noticed that this lipstick kind of emphasizes and emphasizes on the wrinkles or the lines of my lips. So people who have that kind of a lips, please make sure that you do use a lip scrub, a lip balm just before applying it and you're good to go. So yeah, I just wanted to mention that one thing right there. Oh, and uh, just another thing that I had noticed is that this stains your lips. So, I mean, personally, I don't mind that, but just putting it out there. So, I do think that this is worth buying. Uh, if you have the money, go for the full range, or if you're a makeup artist, go for the full range, or else you could just stick to one or two shades. And I also like the concept that they have three models on their websites with different skin tones, and the lipstick is on them. So, that gives you a fair idea like, you know, it gives you an idea if you have to go for a certain shade or not. That's how I picked out my four, and I really love them. So, that's it for today's video, you guys. If you did enjoy my video, do not forget to subscribe to my channel, click on the like button and if you have any questions, comment down below, I'll reply back to you. Do not forget to follow me on my socials and until the next video, take care, bye. And I will...
to budge. Mm. Okay, I think it should be fine. 